due to the fact that I'm going through uh, quite a bit of my, well, I'm struggling quite a bit with chronic fatigue syndrome. Um, it takes me a lot longer to do my videos. It takes me a couple days um, to be able to put a few together. And today I did, I'm, I would like to, and I'm going to talk to you about symptoms of chronic chronic fatigue syndrome. Now that's not all, they won't be all of the symptoms. And if you guys um, that do have chronic fatigue or ME, if you want to put any extra symptoms that you have had in the um, comments, feel free. Uh, it's a huge learning curve for those of us who have chronic fatigue syndrome and for friends and family and, and co-workers, employers, employees, and etc. Um, to understand what we're going through. So in a few minutes, I will be listing those symptoms that I have experienced myself. So yeah, I don't have energy to make myself look beautiful. Um, although today is still July 31st, 2024. I was in bed when, with the last video. Um, it's weird. Um, around 1.30, I kind of started feeling a little bit better. I've been just resting and watching videos and I finally decided to watch a movie just so that I can keep my mind off of things that I should be doing because if I don't do that, I all of my brain will do is tire me out thinking about what I need to do. Um, apart from housework, but business-wise. So, yeah, I don't know what time it is right now, maybe 2.30 or something. Um, but... Yeah, that's where I am right now. I felt, my eyes still feel tired, but I don't feel like I can sleep. Um, I have a strong urge still for sugar. I have that urge every day. I want to get rid of that urge. Um, I just need to learn how. It's August 24, 21st. Um, when it comes to my CFS, um, today I feel a little bit not real energetic. Yesterday I slept until 1 o'clock or 10 to 1, something like that, which I haven't done in a long, 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 long time. So, as in the video, I showed the symptoms. I showed me, uh, I started this video, taking videos probably Friday, so September, sixth I believe um but yeah and I showed a few videos of how I felt during different times in July and August um each day I feel like I'm getting more strength but every time I say that the next day I'm toast because I usually end up overdoing it and I know my doctor told me not to but it's really hard not to when you feel good and you've got lots to do it's just really hard so Anyhow, so yes, today my body hurts so bad. Like, my energy is fine. I don't feel like falling asleep. But my body hurts all over. Um, yeah, so that's the only thing that's bad right now. Um, 
Later, we are going to be talking about other symptoms, more symptoms. I just really want to you all to really understand what it is that even if you look at people and you don't really know, you know, uh, that they have a chronic illness, they're not going to always tell you. You don't know what's going on in somebody's life. Um, and even if they do tell you, you know, I'm not feeling really well today, but they look fine, chances are they're not feeling well. It's just the way it is because it's on the inside. And we learn to mask, we learn to cover it up uh, when we can. There are times that we just can't and you're not gonna see us anyhow because we're gonna be in the house unless it's our family, of course. So yeah, so today I'm gonna be doing a whole lot. I'll be sharing another video of um, cleaning. You know, it takes me a lot longer today than it used to. It used to take me to clean my kitchen no matter how many dishes there were, whether I had to wash them by hand or a dishwasher. It would take me maximum, you know, 45 minutes. And that was a nice, good cleaning, not just surface level cleaning. But now it will take me a good couple hours, maybe three hours, because I have to sit down in between. But anyhow, we'll see you again. Thank you.